Alice, can you talk about the win today and, and to close up out of the first half with the win? Um, like I mentioned it during the week, it, it's very important to finish strong the first, uh, the first part of the season. Um, you know, you get caught up on making plans and, and, and going here and there, and you know, we got some, some players going to Washington, and you get caught up on that and you forget that there's a game especially today, that, that's a tough one to play. And uh, for them to put good at-bats, play good defense, BJ did an outstanding job. The bullpen was outstanding. Um, that, was, that was a good one. Uh, two things. Did you notice the energy and the investment being the same the last few days in the clubhouse and the dugout? Yes, yes. Um, I think um, between the medical staff and, and the coaching staff, uh, they've done a good job recognizing when we have to keep him off the field, batting practice or ground balls and all that, keeping the energy. Um, we ran into some tough days in Washington and Kansas City, and we come here. It was, I mean, the weather was great. Today was a little bit humid, but it, that's nothing compared to what we went through. But keeping them inside in the cage, um, taking care of them throughout the week, um, that, that, that helps. And they kept the energy. They... They know where they at. They finished strong, and now um, just take a few days off, reset, and be ready for Friday. And secondly, any updates on Rodriguez? Yeah, um, you know, um, there there's some serious damage in the ankle. Uh, no surgery required. Uh, we're gonna it's gonna have a boot for two weeks, and then we'll reevaluate to see where he's at. Is it ligament? Yeah, yeah, some ligament damage. Yeah, yeah. But I mean. Not, not, not surgery and all that. That, that, that sounds uh, promising. So we'll see where he's at in two weeks. Can, can you talk about Leon and what if he done the last all, all season with that matter behind Who, plate? Sandy, Sandy. Uh, he, he did a good job this week. Uh, you know, Blake had to play first yesterday, so that was a change of plans. And um, he was ready to catch today. He, He's outstanding behind the play. We know the value. He calls a good game, blocks balls, and he's a leader. And offensively, he, he's done enough. So um, I, th I know he, he'll benefit from the next few days, and uh, he'll be ready for Friday. And then about Embry in the eighth inning, how important was that to get the strikeout to end his threat? Oh, it was huge. Um, he's, been, he's been great the last two months. His numbers against lefties, outstanding. Uh, today, you know, a little bit of bad luck there. Uh, but, you know, Hall, uh, Brock was right in, in the spot where uh, Smoke hit the ball and then the, the ground ball up the middle. But he's been good. Velocity up, good slider, good curveball, good mix of pitches. And, um, you know, we'll, we're very comfortable with him. This has been like three starts this year. Johnson's come this close to getting a win, and he gets nothing out of it. Any part of you say, geez, let's give one more batter and see if we can get that win? No, no. Uh, I think the uh, last time he pitched was the second game in Washington, and um, he gave us 84 pitches. The matchup against uh, Teoscar wasn't good for us in that spot, so um, we went with uh, work. We, we had one out from him today. You know, he, we've been using him a lot. Lately, so <clears throat> we knew that he was going to be the guy. It's a good matchup for us, and we went with it. Um, he'll start on Saturday, by the way. First time since 07, this team has uh, had the best record in baseball going into the All-Star break. Just the significance of the performance over the first half. And obviously, you got more to do, but how do you kind of take that all into totality? Since 07? 07. Oh, well, good. I mean, not too many guys were there in 07. <laughs> Um, I've been saying it. It's, it's all of them. They they do a good job preparing and 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 <clears throat> digesting the information, and they're the ones that go out and perform. Um, I think we've been very consistent throughout the season, and I still feel that we can be better. Uh, there's a few things that we can improve, and uh, that's a good thing. We still got some challenges in front of us, so it's not like uh, because we had a good first part of the season. It's granted that we're gonna go all the way. Uh, we got. Uh, 60, what, 64 more games in the regular season. Uh, we, we're going to keep playing the way we're playing and put pressure on people, and, and, and we win, we lose, we turn the page, keep moving, keep moving. But we're in a good place. I mean, I'm proud of what they, they have accomplished. Um, what does it mean to you that you can relate 
rely on the bottom half of your lineup to come up with runs like no, it's, it's very important. Uh, and we trusted the guys. Uh, I know they, at one point it looked uh, <clears throat> that it, it wasn't going to work out, but they kept working. They, they kept uh, looking for ways to improve. <clears throat> and they're doing an outstanding job. Uh, the way <clears throat> Jackie's swinging the bat right now, uh, he's, he's not only hitting the wall solid, he's putting quality at bats, which is very important. The walk uh, a few days ago um, before the Grand Slam, um, today driving the ball off the wall. He, he's, you can see like the last, what, month and a half, two months, he's been a good hitter, good big league hitter, and that's what we expected. Sandy is doing a good job just like Christian was. And uh, between Eduardo and, and, and Brock, they, they, they're like a complete second baseman. So um, that's very important. You, you get traffic in front of, of Mookie, he's going to take advantage of it. And when Andrew comes back, he'll do the same thing. So we're in a good spot offensively. Um, I know you said Eduardo will be evaluated again in two weeks. Does that make it impossible to say whether or not you guys are optimistic he'll be able to pitch again this season? Or? No, we, we're optimistic. Um, uh, but obviously, we, we got to. Take, take it step by step, um, you know, and that's the first step, see where he's at in two weeks. Yeah. Julian mentioned the 2007 team. Do you see any similarities between this team and that team, Alex? Yeah, me. <laughs> 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 athletic, very athletic. Uh, you know, we had JD and, uh, oh, that's another one, two JDs. We got JD and they have, we have a JD. Uh, we had Drew and Coco, uh, Julio. Yuke was able to run the bases too. Dustin was running the bases. Uh, obviously, the, the two big guys, David and Manny, um, but um, very similar. Uh, the rotation was very solid too. What Josh did that year compares to what what uh, Chris is doing, and, and the other guys threw the ball well. The bullpen was solid too, so we're we're similar. We're similar. With Johnson staying in the rotation, who do you anticipate taking? Uh, Erod spot would that be Velasquez or would you go to Beeks or something? No, the, the the plan is for Hector to be in the bullpen on Friday and he'll start in Baltimore the second game. 